um, chewy. Oh yeah. It falls apart in your chopstick. Yeah. Mm. Oh wow. Konnichiwa and welcome back to Japan. As you can see... Sorry, I'm so distracted already. Uh, as you can see, Tilly has now arrived. The trip has truly begun. Uh, we're in Osaka again, which is famous. Very fitting for Tilly's ar arrival. Uh, for food, street food. Japanese food is obviously insanely good and one of the best things about coming to Japan. So today, we're going to go eat a load of food. We're going to go on our own street food tour and I can't wait. This is us. Oh my god, it's here already. Okay, okay, great. Mm. Uh, should we sit here? Or do you want to go down? It's like deep fried, almost like a pancakey ball with octopus in it, with soy sauce, mayonnaise, ginger, um, spring onion. I want to say fish, fish flakes, which kind of scares me, but you just went in Rome. Do you know what I mean? It's going to be insanely hot. Probably. Look at the steam. Really scared. Tilly doesn't usually like things that are insanely fishy. And these aren't, I just have one, but let's see. You just said it was insanely fishy. I'm trying to hit the dry fish off. No, it is in the it is in the middle where the octopus is. Really fishy. Not really fishy. Oh Tension's building. Oh no. Oh no. Is it just insanely hot? Is it insanely hot? Or you just don't like it? So he doesn't like it, it looks like I'm eating all of these. That's not a problem. So, I, yeah, I didn't love that one. Tilly said you nearly threw up. I wasn't going to tell them that. It was really kind of fishy. There's also dried fish flakes, it's like, um, which I just don't like. I thought it would be crispier. Yes, it's, it's quite like, saggy. It's quite like... Saggy. Saggy? Sorry, soggy. <laughs> it's quite soggy. Don't hold that any closer to my face. Ah. It's quite soggy. I thought it would be crispier, but it's quite like a soggy thing. And it's quite wet, isn't it? Like, <laughs> I don't know if we can put this in the video. It's very, yeah. I like them. You like them? They're not like the most amazing things I've ever had, but they're, they're pretty damn good. Is the flavor nice? Yeah. I was trying not to try the flavor. Of the octopus? Of anything. <laughs> Pick it up and it just like falls apart in your chopsticks. Yeah. Okay. Enough of the saggy balls. We're now going to the famous cheese cookie waffle thing. Do you don't want the custard one? No. No custard. Where's my cheek? I think you pushed the that in. Oh, it's like sweet. Right, let's try this famous cheese coin, which Tilly's probably gonna have to eat most of as I just ate all those octopus okay, balls. Got it. Good. It looks really good. It was like sweet though. Mmm. Oh wow. Sweet. Yeah. Is that just the outside pastry bit though? Oh my god, it's so good. A cheesy mouth. That was really good. But this is sweet. It's like sweet pastry. So Alright, let me try some. The cheese is a bit rogue, but... What kind of cheese is it? A mozzarella. A mozzarella. Oh, it's just like pancake. That's what I'm eating. It's like a sweet waffle. It's like a waffle. When cheese is in the middle, go for a big cheesy bite. Oh wow. Nice. Yeah. It's good, isn't it? It goes really weirdly well. It doesn't taste what I think like. It doesn't taste very like Japanese though, does it? It's no. almost like American. Yeah. 
especially mozzarella. And a, in a waffle. In a waffle. In a waffle. Oh, it's delicious. Hey, don't eat too much. This is like exactly what I imagine Japanese cities yeah. to look like. There's people everywhere, lights everywhere, food. So like colourful and cartoony. Yeah, it's like it's like a type being in an anime yeah. real life. It's lit, I like it. It's so different from other Asian countries. This is so cool. This is why I would recommend coming here at night. And on a Saturday, it's Saturday Tour guide today. Tilly says, come here at night. Definitely come at night, it makes the lights better. And at the weekend, even though you got to wait a bit longer for food, it's carnage. I tell you about what I said about coming on a Saturday, don't do that. We've got a queue for an hour to get into you this place. You literally said that for a minute ago. I know I did, and now I regret it. Okay. Um. Yeah, we've got a queue for an hour. We're having, I'm probably going to absolutely butcher this. I'll, I'll research after I should have done it before. Okonomiyaki. That sounded solid. Okonomiyaki. Okonomiyaki. Essentially some sort of wheat flour pancake thing, I believe, with like egg savory, and right? topi toppings. F toppings. I hope it's savory because I feel a bit sweet after that cheese waffle. Yeah, it's kind of good we have an hour to digest that cheese yeah. thing. Um, but yeah, was... we'll, we'll, we'll see you in an hour when we get inside this place. <laughs> Hopefully it'll be worth the wait. I think it will be. Sorry, this is so cool. We've made it inside and it looks amazing. I know you can see us in here. <laughs> wow. So it's like egg and like... It smells so good. I know. Do you know what I mean? I guess it's like omelette, but, but, but like... Yeah. With. Yeah, it's just really no thanks, no thanks. What is that? That's the dried fish flakes. His first beer in Japan. Been here a week and this is the first sip of beer. You've only been here a week? Eight days. Fair. Nice. So good. Sapporo, which is brewed in the north in Hokkaido. How do you know all this? Japanese. Our delicious pancake thing is cooking in here. Oh! Yeah. Mustard and mayonnaise. Yeah. Mustard and mayonnaise. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Oh! Wow! 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 Okay, you'll go. You want to try some? Okay. <laughs> Look hot. We still don't really know what it is. Yeah. Oh, it smells good. Mmm. Mm. That's the same. Well, that's good. Looks like leek or spring onion. Spring onion. This is a neggy egg. Oh, I got it. No idea. <laughs> Number two. I'm sorry, that's a bit of pinchy. Mm, I love no, you've cheated. You've ruined the taste test and its authenticity is now in question. I think I'll it. That's a big piece. Yeah, we've opted to not get the mustard and mayonnaise this time because we thought it was a bit, I don't know, like overpowering. And everyone knows what mustard and mayonnaise tastes like. So. It's not spring onion. What's it like? Nice. Good? So maybe use kind of a sauce from this to kind of... Yeah, spread it out a bit. Yes. Cheers. You'll like this one. Mm. What do you think? There's less egg, it's less omelette-y. It's very... Um, it's more just like really well seasoned vegetables. Very light, isn't it? Yeah. This is how advanced vending machines are in this country. Wow. Here you go, Ed. Look, my straw is ready. Whoa, you get a straw ready. Oh, it's got a It's hot. It's hot. Uh -huh. Oh, no, that. No, but that's hot. It's no, I mean, it's freshly sealed, that's why. I just love orange juice. Is it fresh? It's 
so good. So now we're having some gyozas, which are one of my favourite foods in the world. Oh. Tilly's in heaven. Thank you. Thank you. Oh yeah. It might be like actually like a vinegary thing. Do you want some of this? I may put some of that in the corner. Good idea, Eds. That's I'm fine. Full of good ideas, me. We make the perfect team. Oh yes. They're probably gonna be better than the 7-Eleven ones we had last night. They will be. Hot? Or oh, are they good? I love bios. You just can't beat it. They're so good. But they're actually Chinese. Dumpling, aren't they? They're actually Chinese. Well, you just said that. I mean, yeah. We thought they were Japanese. The I whole did time, think they were Japanese, but no, they're Chinese. Are they good? <coughs> For our last dish of the day, we're getting some. What is this? It's a rice dumpling in like a sweet soy sauce. Flavour. It's a soybean flavour. I don't really know. Um, I don't actually have an absolute clue what it is. Like everybody would eat it today. You look like you're scared of it. I just have no clue how to eat it. <laughs> you hate it, don't you? It's like yeah. the octopus falls all over again. I don't hate it. Okay. I believe you. It's very um chewy. Really? I don't really know what the, what it is. How to describe it? It's kind of like a gummy flavour. It's not gum, but like chewy flavour, isn't it? Like look inside it. Nice? Mm. There's something that it's like that I can't remember right now. <laughs> Least informative food video ever. We're just calling it like two idiots eating Japanese food. All right, that's a wrap on our chaotic, oh. chaotic food tour. Guys, this place is amazing. Yeah, Tilly's in heaven here. It's just amazing. Just every like, look in there. Like look. I don't know if you can see, but it's just like this tiny little sushi bar with just like people making food. Oh, look at that look huge at that. eel. It's a big eel. So I mean, it's just like your senses are just so overwhelming it's and true. exciting. It, every single like little restaurant you come across just looks so nice. But I guess it would have to be to survive in a place like this. Yeah, but it's just the ambiance is just amazing. Like it's just so quaint and cute. And I just could just imagine like spending all evening there, like you eating, know, eating, drinking beer, like drinking the rice wine and just like, Chatting absolute rubbish to you. Yeah, it sounds Good about time. right. Sounds about look right. Look at this. Look at this. All right, this is already turning into the longest outro of all time. Um, we're stuffed. We're stuffed. Understandably, we're gonna go home and sleep. So yeah, thanks for watching. Um, drop a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new, and we'll see you next week from another part of Japan. Who knows where? Bye. We don't. So you don't.